Hey, what's up guys? It's Junqin here and today I'm going to review a cell bar. It's bigger than the previous one and also including a controller. But most importantly, it's not just only one cell bar. It comes with a subwoofer as well. Could it be the best sound system for you to watch 50 Shades of Could it be the best audio system for you to watch to rewatch Avengers Endgame? I don't know man, let's get started. DT5500 Sonic Bar Air Pass. As usual, all the speaker and soundbar from Sonic Gear right now supports Bluetooth 5.0. Oh, I'm so glad that because all the time I've been using Spotify and also I play music everywhere else in my house, not just only in one room. It not only supports Bluetooth 5.0, it also supports AUX mode, FM mode, USB mode. So for input wise, it supports HDMI and optical. With the included subwoofer, for sure you can enjoy the best audio while you are watching movie or playing video game. It has a decent bass with tiny little muffling sound which is still acceptable for me. And I can even enjoy the great bass in Avicii's music. Here's where you can control the soundbar, but somehow I find out the function on each button is quite complicated because some have to hold to change the mode, some don't have to hold, just one tap, it will change the mode. So I prefer to use a controller to change the mode or also to volume up, volume down, play, pause and other function button. Subwoofer doesn't have any control center, all you need to control is just the soundbar as both of them are well synced. That's a review for the Sonic Gear BT5500 Bluetooth 5.0 soundbar air pass. So let me know in the comment below if you have any comments about this woofer or this soundbar or maybe me myself. It's the Jinjin again, let's here. Peace out. I'll see you next.